Hey everyone, back again. Welcome back to another video review. This time we will be taking a look at the Transformers Robots in Disguise um, Bidicon class dive bomb. As you can see, he, his alternate mode is a uh, torpedo. His primary colors mostly are all well, this light purple. This has some like light maroon red. It does have the downloadable Decepticon symbol for the game. Um, but yeah, this is meant to be his torpedo mode, as I said. Of course, he's one of the minicons, um, main minicons for Fracture, the other one being Air Razor. But Air Razor obviously will be with uh, the Deployer version of Fracture, as with, will Jetstorm be with Drift, as I mentioned in the Slipstream video. But yeah, all in all, the torpedo mode's very cool. Wish could be a little more show accurate, but all in all, it's not too bad. Much like all minicons, does come with this big Decepticon symbol. Right here, this one is like this translucent green, much similar to the Convoy No Nazo game from many years ago. We have to kill one of the. It's funny, one of the main bosses is the Decepticon symbol three times. Anyways, it does come with a couple accessories, or many accessories. It comes with these wings here, very cool. He comes with these, these little mini wings here as well. So he has two sets of wings. It comes with comes with these two little dual launchers, these little little handguns. Comes with this, I think this is, I'm assuming this is the chest plate and this uh, battle mask here, so very cool. Although pretty, pretty neat. Anyways, so to transform a dive bomb, what you want to do, it's very easy. Pull, this, I'll, I'll show that again. Split the legs here like so, extend, that will automorph the rest of the figure and then just flip down the feet. Of course the box says one step but I think they kinda failed on their part because it seems like three steps. Anyways, but the air of dive bomb in this robot mode, although it is very stocky, very stocky for its size I must say. Articulation wise, he really doesn't have any articulation. Um, okay, you can wiggle the arms up and down but that's due to transformation. The legs are can wiggle side to side, forward and back, and then the feet is real, like like a definite possibility right there. Take a look at his face here. Uh, if we take a look here, it is very interesting. It reminds me a lot of well, <laughs> it, okay, really, it's kind of show accurate, kind of not show accurate, but it, it just looks like it looks like G1 Galvatron for some reason. I don't know why. Anyways. The accessories, uh, just as an example, real quick, uh, you can actually you can give him his weapons here. Like so you can give him his. Let's see, where is it? Oh, nope. There we go. You can give him his battle mask. Just basically plug it over his head like so. Okay, no, it doesn't work, but. And then you can give. It's just a, as proof of concept. You can also give him his. You can, or now the the wings don't fit. Oh well, but basically you can give him his his weapons in his hand, and yes, you can armor them in vehicle mode. It requires another step if uh, you want to transform back to to uh, torpedo mode. Anyways, all in all, well, I recommend getting dive bomb. I'm going to say yes if you want to complete the entire um, the entire cast of the of the Autobot Decepticons that we've had so far in the series. I'd say go get him. He's a pretty cool figure. Um, obviously, it's kind of a shame that Air Razor is exclusive to Fracture in the Deploy Deploy version, but it doesn't bother me that much. And same with Drift and Jetstorm. But all in all, if you want to get, if you really want a figure that's pretty cool and is pretty easy to transform and want to carry around with you wherever you go, I'd say get this figure. I think it's a pretty pretty neat looking figure. A little hollow in some places, but all in all, it's not too bad regardless. So yeah, that's my video review of the Transformers um, Robots in Disguise Minicon Class Dive Bomb. I'll see you all very soon. I'll be back as soon as possible in the next video. And yeah, so take care. See you soon. Have a great day and I'll catch you all later. Bye-bye.